In 19th century Argentina, Inspector Eduardo Alvarez is pushing the limits of forensic science. He hopes to prove whether a man suspected of murdering two young children is guilty or not. And he's going to do it in a way that no one's ever done before. By using a bloody fingerprint left at the crime scene. While Alvarez had the critical insight that this could be possible, he does not have the science background to test his theory. Fortunately, he knows someone who does, his friend and mentor, Juan Vucic. Vucic had been studying fingerprints for years. He had understood that they were individual, that they didn't change through life, that they were valuable pieces of information for identity. But how will they know for sure if the prints match up? What they were looking at is the pattern of what we call friction ridges, and that's what allows us to grasp and hold stuff. But the arrangement of the friction ridges is complex. There are all kinds of lines and circles and dots. So Vucic comes up with a way to simplify the classification of fingerprints, a method that's still in use today. Each fingerprint is dominated by one of three primary patterns. The first is an arch, which is like a tent. The second is a loop, like one made with a shoestring. And the third is called a whirl, which looks like a whirlpool. Vucic proposed using these patterns as a sorting tool. If two prints prove to be different types, there's no need to look any further. But if they're in the same category, then they're worth a closer look. You look at the individual points, the ending ridges, the splitting ridges, the dots that appear. Ridge endings are places where the ridges start and stop as they flow through the pattern. In other places, a ridge will split in two, also known as a bifurcation. A dot is a ridge that is as long as it is wide. The unique arrangement of these ridge characteristics clearly distinguishes one print from another. Vucic spends hours studying the two prints, ridge by ridge, trying to match dots, bifurcations, and ridge endings. He's looking for these characteristics to match up in the same location and in the same arrangement. But the more he looks, the more he realizes the fingerprints don't match. <laughs> 